And here is the delicious eggplant parmesan. Start with fresh eggplant from your garden or your local store. I prefer uh, organic whenever I can get it. Peel and slice. Then you're gonna be putting it in an egg bath and we're going to bread it. Okay, this is where I put my daughter to work. So I'm soaking these in egg bath, which is just eggs. You can put milk in there if you like, but I don't need to. Then we're going to go ahead and have her coat them, and then I'm going to put them in the uh, or put them in the plant pan to fry them up. Yes, I know frying is not always the healthiest, but remember we are getting a little health back by using eggplant instead of chicken. So we're going to go ahead and fry these up. I always use pure avocado oil when I am cooking because it's got high heat and a neutral flavor. So when I'm frying or cooking, I'm always using avocado oil. I'm going to stick this on medium heat and we're going to fry this up. All right, so they're frying up. To reduce the amount of oil that I put in, I just basically place them on a paper towel once they're done and that'll soak up some of that oil some of that excess oil so it doesn't wind up in your finished eggplant parmesan. Once you have fried these up and let the oil kind of drain from them, you're going to want to grab a pan that you're going to put in the oven. You're going to want tomato uh, sauce, which we use, and some cheese. And you're going to want to go ahead and layer them in the pan and you're going to have leftovers so with leftovers you want to just put them in the freezer they'll freeze up nice and you can cook another dish once the leftovers are when you're ready to use them start with a layer of tomato sauce on the bottom and then just start placing in your eggplant Then just start sprinkling on your Parmesan cheese and layer your, layer your dish. Next up is going to be the red sauce and then another layer of cheese and then the red sauce until you fill up to the top of your pan. Make sure that the last layer is cheese and then you're going to put it in your oven at 390 until everything melts together. All right, so you've got like, you basically did like a layered lasagna with the eggplant. I'm gonna put this in the oven and I'll show you the end result. All right, and so here is the finished eggplant parmesan. I'm gonna plate it for you so you can see, but this is cooked up in the oven. And now I'm gonna put some noodles on a plate and put it um, all together. And here is the delicious eggplant parmesan. Bon appétit